Hello everyone, this tutorial is about how to uh, let students submit big files uh, by creating links and submitting it to uh, Moodle or iStudy. So, uh, because uh, this is the more efficient way to use the disk space of our servers and the bandwidth of our school. So if you have big files, first of all you have to modify your assignments so that uh, your assignments will be able to submit so this is this this is how you're going to see it students will submit assignments as urls and uh, so i'm going that's what we're going to show you and student this is how the student is going to we'll also show you how the student can how you can tell your students to submit their requirements okay so first of all let me just uh, remove this submission we want to start from scratch first I have two windows here one for the teacher and one for the student okay so this is my uh, experimental class and this is the test assignment as at uh, okay let me go back to my class as a teacher you want to create an assignment normal assignment submission but you want to edit that and make it instead of file submission where students will upload files you want that to be the online text where p students can type <coughs> or paste text instead of up uploading the file or you can enable both and do you tell the students in our school in I'm taking a course in University of the Philippines the teacher usually says if your file is too big just paste a link to an external site but some teachers of our teachers just ask all of us to put online text so uh, so that it's not complicated so if you put it to online text instead of file submissions, students will not be able to upload their files. So remember, you set it to online text instead of file submissions as a teacher. Now this is what the students are going to see. Let me go to the student. So I'll just refresh this. So when the student clicks, I'm a student here, see? Okay, if you look here up, it's, it's me as a student. When I click in the test assignments and I edit submission, I will not be able to upload a file. I'll just be able to type texts here, uh, text here. So what I'm going to do, for example, my assignment is this. I made a presentation and I uploaded it in Google Drive and I want to pass it as an assignment so I'm going to right click this in Google Drive how did I get it here for the students I just dragged it from the Windows Explorer I just dragged it here and it was uploaded here I just get shareable link that is a right click right click get shareable link and then make sure everybody with the link uh, can view and then copy and then the student can paste it here is my assignment book paste it here and then select the whole link click this uh, link button like a chain and then also paste the same link here and preferably click open in new window so say the student can save changes and that's his submission her submission here is my assignment book and that's the link what are you going to see as a teacher as the teacher this is me as a teacher for example, I turn editing off when I click this test assignment. 
and I view all submissions I'm going to see the link like when I click this a new window will open and I can read whatever the student uh, chose to research about or submit about whether it's a video uh, an excel file or whatever kind of document a presentation or whatever or a graphic or a program or a website everything should be a link and then you can grade it so as a review you have to make the assignment you have to make the assignment uh, instead of an upload you have to make it online text by clicking edit settings and instead of file submission make it online text text and the student can just paste the URL from whatever site he got it from. I hope that works.